Welcome back, any lovers. Today we are checking out Station of the Station, so you're going to grab yourself a plate. This is an amazing little game that I got a chance to go play the demo for. And it is a wonderful little puzzle game that I I put my full... I was so happy when I saw this show, show up in my, uh, in my email box and be like, man, I am happy. It is such a relaxing puzzle game that you're building connections between the two stations, but you're also building connections between like farms and everything and, and sending resources in the best possible way, shortest routes, um, connecting connecting multiple stations, stuff like that. It, it's really honestly quite cool how they handled this game. I'm very impressed. So we're gonna hop in here and check the game for a little while. If you do like it, of course, please check the links down below that it is releasing as of today. I'm uh, very excited to see the Coliseum here. Hopefully we can see that today. So it's gonna hop in here again. If you like anything else, of course, about the channel, or you want to be able to follow us outside the channel or support us monetarily, you're more than welcome to. It is going to be the links down below. All of those links will go ahead and lead you there. And I'm going to turn down a little bit because the music, as amazing as it is, is just a little, little loud. It's wonderful. It's wonderful. Don't get me wrong. It's wonderful, but it's loud. <laughs> Let's go with level one. I see they changed the UI already. I like that. But I mean, I, I, I like games. If this is how this is going to be. This is the water. Don't worry, not a beer. Um, if they do, if they do what I hope they do, I hope that the, I hope that the tutorial was a different. Oh, this is nice. I hope that the tutorial was a different game than this. I see the tutorial is, or not the tutorial. I hope the prologue that we played was is going to be different than um than what we played now you know press space bar or a station play stations rotate z and x so i'm trying to get that to that right that needs that needs wheat that produces wheat so what we're trying to do is we're going to put a station yeah and we're going to put a station here. Like so. The middle requires is click, click on the connector to the station to build. Yep. So we're going to build this to this. Ta-da! Stand for a train. The mill received wheat and you got money. Received money it also unlocks new buildings. Okay, a ton of them. Holy crap. Cover the building that see what is completed. Wheat's completed. Each wheat farm can supply only one mill, so the new wheat farms need to be connected to a different mill so that the one is already used. So this is gonna need this needs wheat, this needs wheat. So we're gonna place one. I like to make sure that my railroad is going this way, or like the way my stations are going in a way where they can go around. So if I need to like, let's say I need to drive this one this way or something like that, I can do that. When I first played this game, I worried about trains colliding into each other. Actually, we're gonna do this. Like that. See that? See, I'm kind of like laying everything, making sure that I've got that I've got everything laid out a little differently. Make sure that I've got things laid out so if something happens, I need to like ship the wheat someplace, so I need to move something. That's kind of how I'm doing this here. Start building from the station. Tricky terrain. Control the direction of your road by clicking the highlighted area. This bridge is very expensive, so let's redirect the track through the canyon. Click on the road to insert an anchor point. Avoid pulling bridges by using anchor points to redirect the railroad through the oh. Oh, that is expensive. Okay, cool. Oh, I didn't know about the anchor point. That's cool. 
Is that a new thing? Get the supply demand in the new building. Milk, milk, produces milk. And all oh, little things pop up like that. Okay. I love that. I don't remember that being in the demo, but I like that. Remember this. We're going to do this. And we're going to do this. So this one's going to go to this one. But we're gonna make sure to zoom around the wall. And get like a scenic view. Oh, that one goes right over oh, right through the wall almost. See that? Boom. Level complete. Yeah. Press the button in the bottom right corner once you're ready to go to the next level. Level is completed. That was our objective. Did you see a little puppy? Oh, oh, I missed it. There was a little puppy. Star challenge, spare no expenses, incomplete. Create long robots. Okay, so this is all the tutorial, I think. And then I go to the region locked. I go to this one, this one, this one, this one. Okay, I got you. I'm gonna move over um, as soon as possible. Uh, create all 14 buildings. Create long railroad so that all their lanes combine exceed 20 or 2200. Oh, sorry, I got a hair in my mouth. 2200 meters. I can do that. Hover over the new building, see what it does. It produces, it needs flour, but it produces bread. This bakery needs flour from the mill, and this mill needs wheat first. Okay. So you need wheat, and you produce wheat. How convenient. I think I'm going to build myself. One like that, and then you're gonna have one that's gonna go like this, and then you're gonna have one because you're probably gonna have to produce or put this out somewhere. So we're gonna do there, and then we're gonna do this to there. I didn't talk about combos yet either. Oh, wait, there's an anchor point. Wait. Oh, I messed up. I messed up. I messed up. I meant to hit the anchor button there and... I messed up. Can I go back? I guess money doesn't matter in this one. Let's just do it. Yeah, I guess money isn't a big thing in this. There's fish. Oh, fish wasn't in the other one. There's a city, so you need bread, milk, cheese, and yeah, see? So now, this is really funny. So now, what you do is, you place a station, right? Make sure it connects up to the, the city. Now this is producing bread. This is producing flour. So it's a little station here. And then what you're gonna do is, you're gonna, gonna pop down here. That's bread going there. So now bread's set up. And then we're gonna pop another station over here. And that station's gonna go right here. Yeah. Now that probably gonna be the milk rate. And they give you the dairy, the cheesery. I mean, I could really cheese it and really put some crazy patterns out here so we get a lot more, a lot more railroad, you know what I mean?
because you're like, oh, it eliminates another rail. Yeah, it does, but you can also kind of connect these so everything goes through one rail system. And this is a combo. You get more money if you stack everything like that. You produce wheat. You need wheat to play flower. And then you need flower. So what you can do now is... So. So you can take this, right? And I can connect this to here. Like this. So I'll put this like this, right? And then we'll, we'll go over here. And do that. And we'll go over here. And do that. Okay. So who's producing first? This this produces wheat. This wheat needs flour. So then what we do is we connect this to here. And then we finally connect this one to here. That should be it, right? Boom. And there you go. And see how that, now see how this connects all the way over here to connect all the way over here. Ta-da! And you have multi trains going with multiple things like the milk. That's the milk, and that's bread, I guess, and stuff like that. Yeah. Ta da! That's why I love you. You can just connect between stations. There's many buildings. It'd be hard to maintain a good overview. Press tab to view incompleted buildings. Incompleted buildings produces bread. You're doing it. You're producing bread. Is that a city? That's fish. That's milk. Needs milk for cheese. Okay. That's gonna supply bread there. Okay. Honestly, I'd like a stacking bonus if I can. And since money ain't really no object. Ooh, what's that? Wait. Look at the little horsey. It's so cute. Okay. So you need milk, right? You need fish. And you need milk, fish, cheese, and bread. So, what we do here is... We... Place a station. We need to connect that station with this. this. This is only because money is not a thing. If money was a thing, this might work. I would just run a line right there, but because money's not a thing right now, money will be a thing, trust me. Oh, money will be a thing. We can add fish right there. Stack it, bonus. The bread didn't work out very well, but whatever. I could have figured out the bread too, probably. But basically, what you do is you're trying to put everything into one into one station. Yeah, you're trying to put all the railroads into one station, and then connect that one station to whatever you're trying to get, whatever you're trying to hit. So, like, 
I got this going around here, all here. So it goes into here. So this way, this station. Oh, sorry. I got the bread going into the the cheese, and I've got the fish going into the milk, and I got the milk going into the cheese, so it produces the cheese. But the cheese is the the main station that's going to go into town. So everything hooks up to that main station to go into the one spot to stack, and that's where your stacking bonuses come in. Same thing over here. Everything over here is stacked up. Everything's over here stacked up, and then I push that into there, so it all is a stacking bonus. Um, I didn't get the star. So I'm just gonna bullshit for a second, one second. God, you need to waste a lot of railway system. Holy crap. Look at this. <laughs> They're literally just like, yeah, just use a bunch of stations. Make it as expensive as possible, please. There we go. <laughs> it doesn't make sense. I just connected everything, so whatever. Cool. I had to complete all five of these to get to the to get to the main one. Okay. Oh, I did not read what I had to do. Crap. There we go. End the level with at least $500 left. Complete the level without creating more than 2,000 of railroads. So this one's create less. Say less. Okay, you oh, mill. Something's under construction. Oh, something is under construction. That's cool. So you're going to, oh yeah, you're going to produce everywhere. Oh yeah, this one's gonna be big. All right, I will try my best. This is where stacking bonus is, is going to be amazing. Indirect connection is say row cost is bakery you can receive flour indirectly via station. Yep, see, uh, see, they, I, I've already, I've already, I've already obviously played this game, so I already know what's going on. I do wish that you could, um, sorry about my mic. I wish you could hop on the trains. That'd be so much fun to stick an indirect route or indirect train. Look at this. It's going literally right next to the field it's so cozy also gonna be very cheesy with the network resources can indirect travel over many stations yeah see now it's like oh hey by the way you can uh, totally do this it's gonna want me to not go over this because if you go over this it's a bridge for $41. See, see how much it costs? See how much this is the difference in cost of the bridge you have to build? There was a green. There was a green somewhere. There it is. Boom. Right there. Here that one because this needs milk. So we're gonna connect that. And then this one needs this. If I remember correct, I think this was part of the tutorial, and I think there's a trick coming up. I think they're gonna like have you do all this, and then all of a sudden they're gonna be like, by the way. 
Uh, I'm gonna do this outer one. I try to save the inner ones for other things. Let's see that. It's now the received area because it's connected to the same network. Ta-da! Now connect the fish docks and the city to the network to supply everything in the city at once. Yes! So now we do this. So this is when a major bonus comes in. Now we do this. Then the city goes... You connect here. You connect here first. And then you connect here so you get a stacking bonus. Boom. I get bonus is the way to really start getting some money going. All about the money, baby. City in the middle, of course. <laughs> of course. Um, all right, so obviously we're gonna build a bakery flour. This needs flour. This needs milk. This needs wheat. That's a dairy farm. That's a wheat farm. And then fish, of course. Ultimately, the fish is what we're gonna want to drive to the city at the end of the day just like it did before just like we did before we're gonna want to do that so this is gonna be the milk so what we want to do is we want to make sure that this like we're gonna hook these up right to here. Wait, what am I doing that for? Wait, wait, wait. Literally just do that. <laughs> like, wait, I can just do that. Wait, what's that? Okay. And this is going to... Actually, wait, I can just stock, I can do this, right? I got exactly what I can do. I can totally do this. Anchor this. This comes around like that. Perfect. And this goes here. Oh, I shouldn't have connected this first. Dang it. Oh, wait, I can do so though. I can still do this. Yeah, we're still good. Yeah, I shouldn't have connected the town. Dang it. Can I go back? No, we're reload checkpoint. Let's reload checkpoint. Oh, no, I have to do the whole thing. Oh, no, this one. Okay, cool. Oh, that's a checkpoint. Dang it. Okay, I might not finish this. I might not finish this right. We'll see. We'll see. Maybe I still will. Maybe I still will. We'll see. Okay, 
Every dollar counts. Every dollar counts. I say that that stacking bonus is what I needed, but we'll see. This is gonna be a huge stacking bonus here, so we'll do this. Oh, that's huge. Funding challenge done. And I did on your oh yeah, there we go. There we go, baby. Knocked out all the challenges that one. That was good. That was good. Finished the level with a lot of money left. <laughs> uh, quickly complete the level without placing any bridges. Ooh. This will be a trick. In the level with at least seven hundred dollars left, complete the level without placing any bridges. Okay. That means we're gonna have to connect everything around the, the lane we're not going across here, and we're gonna have to go up all ramps. It means we have to snake it down the, the yeah, we have to snake it down the, the area here. That's exactly what we have to do. We have to snake everything down and snake it back up. All right, this is a bakery. It's flour. That's a wheat. So yeah, I'm gonna connect those two first. I have a feeling it's gonna want me to go down this way to some place. I bet. Yeah, it's gonna want me to come up here. I bet you. I bid money on that. You're about to create an expansive road and break the railroads around the coast of the anchor. Yeah, yeah, I'm, 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 I'm working on it. I'm working on it. One second, one second, one second. Yeah, see? I'm working on it, see? There you go. Not a bridge in sight, see? Not a bridge in sight. I don't feel like this one's gonna get another runoff, so I'm just gonna, gonna go with this. Let's anchor that. No, excuse me. Let me anchor this. Not destroy Mother Nature either, because I saw the trees come back. Oh, no. No, no. It wants me to destroy Mother Nature, so we'll do that. No bridges. No bridges. There we go. Um, now this is going to produce all these. So this is both going here, which is awesome. I have a feeling we're going to have to run something off of this, so we're going to run that. It's like just testing me how I can anchor. That's what it is. This is all about anchoring. Must be from Alaska, because this is all anchorage. <laughs> Sorry. Um, that's a bad dad joke. Um, <laughs> there we go. Okay, so that's good there.
Why the double fishery? Oh, because the double city. That's cute. Okay, so you need everything. Oh, you can remove them. Okay, cool. I guess before, maybe after you place them. Can you remove them after you place them? Yeah, okay, there we go. Never mind. So you need all that stuff. I'm guessing milk is going to come from up there. This one's like just connect the fisheries, I think. How can I make this a stacking bonus? Then this is probably going to be milk there, and that's probably going to be able to connect to there. So I'll do this. city with this. And this will come up to here. <laughs> Excuse me. I should build the easy side first. Dang it. <laughs> uh, this one's going to be... Yeah, I'm going to go through there. Bridges, no bridges. Okay, cool. We're cool. We're good. Stack them up. Okay, doing well so far. Doing well. Where's this one going to come from? This one's going to come from up here. Which is just going to be... This, this is going to just go... This is the easier side, I think. This is the side where it's just like, oh, just connect everything. Just connect me. No, I don't want to do that yet. I want to do... I want to destroy the fields. Yes. See, we saw this one coming. It needs milk to produce cheese. So as we hit this dairy farm thing as far out as it'll let me. And then same thing with this. If this lets me put it all the way out there, we will. So we just reduce the amount of... Right? Yeah, okay, cool. That's good. And then we run this one straight down. But we anchor the crap out of it. Yeah, we anchor the crap out of it. Oh, this is just without bridges. I've, I'm thinking that... Man, I'm sitting here thinking I have to like, watch out for my lines. I, it's just money and bridges. Okay, cool.
Now city's complete, right? Okay, city complete. And I'm pretty sure I'm good here. This one's gonna be, a, I think this one's gonna be a tough one. We're gonna wanna run it up that wall there. So we're gonna run up there. And this one's gonna run this way. Those two. I love the sound of the the train. I love the, or the sound the sound of the the things being um the the tracks being laid. Is it the train? Oh, the tracks. Oh, the train. Okay, and that's how I wanted to do that one. Yeah, that sounds about right. Finish with a buttload of money, too. There's that one train that I hit that was so pretty. Can you imagine doing this train right here? Look at this going through the wheat field. Look how beautiful that is! How gorgeous that is. And I wish we could, uh, I wish we could hop in and, and view, like, go for the view stations. That'd be so much fun. I would love doing that. That'd be so great. Look at the horsies! $900. Save a total amount of $300 by using cards. Oh. Oh, yeah, that's right. The card system now, too. That's right. Use cards to reduce the cost of railroads. Just like new buildings, cards can be attained after connecting resources. There are many different cards that have their own unique usage. Um, okay, so I have to connect you, too. Gotcha. And you're not going to go anywhere, so I'm just going to put you there. What are, what are you? You're a fishing dock, and you're a city. Cool. And you're going to have multiple connections, so we're going to go ahead and then pump you up. There we go. And we'll enable that, so we got some cheap rails. And we'll go there. Boom. It only gave me enough money to do it, too. See that? All right, pull the cards. Cheap bridges, nice. Pull the bullets. Oh god, cheap bridges, man. We gotta say, make sure that we're connecting everything the right way first. You're building something there, so I could definitely pull off that one if I need to. But I want to kind of make this a central hub here in the middle. Do cheap bridges. Oh, they're telling me I have to produce this right now. Let me connect the city yet. See, I'm, I'm thinking ahead. Ah, oh, dang. Yo. Oh, Jesus. Okay, cool. Another thing with at least $900 left? Jesus. Okay. So, cheesery, wheat. Right? Dairy. Bakery. Bakery. 
Wheat farm is produced in one wheat. This needs a little bit of flour. Bakery needs flour. This needs milk. Or this, sorry, to produce this milk. This needs flour for the bakery. This needs flour for the bakery. Cheese really needs milk. So I'm going to have to, like, literally go all the way around here. Oh, I could, I could connect everything. connect these two because this definitely has to come down here everything's going to connect to the city so that's going to be like my big ta-da is connecting everything to the city Let's say I'm going to have to make multiple connections right off the bat. Just to be able to afford all this. If I connect this one first... cheap rails and I run a rail there that puts me enough money in my pocket to do that These two are obviously going to be connected. I need the cheap bridges as it gets to the city. I think I'm pretty sure. And this is a pretty cheap rail, so I'm not too worried about this one. It's a lot of money, though. So I think I have to go piece by piece. Can I put one between the two? No. This is going to be a cheap rail moment right here. I know that for a fact. So that produces that. That goes to that. Right? do cheap rails to come over here.
It's gonna be so, so close. That's 25 bucks? Jesus. So I want some type of stacking bonus. <laughs> oh, I was so close. I was so close. Not, not at all. Um, oh, there's more. Oh, I thought that was it. Okay. I'm sitting here trying to like produce this whole thing and I'm like, man, I, I failed. Instead of running it all the way up there, you just run it through this. Like that. You do cheap bridges. Okay. You do cheap rails. Actually, could have. I could have put this into this, and we're not worried about the bridge and just go with here. Damn, I didn't think about that. Uh, okay, I see you now, game. A little hill? That is a little hill. Okay, cool. No, don't connect that yet. <laughs> Let me connect this to that. Everything gets shipped over there. Gosh, 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 gosh. That works out so well. Ta-da! Greendale's done! I did, I did Greendale. Beautiful. Sunforge Sands is the next one. Look at this. This is bad boy. Then you have Riverbend Woods, you have Flint Hills, you have Golden Dunes, and you have the Evening Star Valley. I love it. Thank you so much for joining me for the Indie Buffet, folks, where we'll help you find your next favorite indie. Peace.